welcome back to my channel it's your girl Monique so today we're going to be doing another finish getting ready with me and just kind of chit chatting about a very important topic that I feel like not many people talk about but many people especially nowadays go through it before we get started we're going to be focusing on the eyes and the lips what that we're going to be using today is the magic by Juvia's but today's topic guys is baby mama before we jump into the topic i'm going to start off by getting a little bit of nana a burnt orange brown color the amazing man that i'm dating right now he is a father and um i don't have any kids and this is the first time i've dated anyone that has children well i have like I've talked to guys before with kids, but it's never what it is right now. I met my boyfriend. He was definitely very honest. The fact that, you know, he has children, the fact that he has a baby mother, and we were just friends. So for me in the beginning, it was like, oh, okay, well, it ain't my problem, you know? <laughs> it was just like, okay, cool, that's good to know. I'm glad you told me. We decided to take our friendship to the next level. I knew that once my boyfriend and I, we made things official, I was eventually going to be meeting his children and also the mother of his children too. Honestly, the first thing that I did, guys, I prayed. I had to pray about it. I'm getting a little bit of Kessie, by the way, guys, and I'm going to put that underneath my eyebrow, my, um, my brow bone. They live pretty far, so normally he just goes and picks them up and then he comes back to Georgia. And then he spends um, like the summer with them but he this time he wanted me to go with him I wanted to go with him and I wanted to meet them in person but I told him that I wanted to do things different than what I guess how most people have done it I actually wanted to meet the mother for his children first um, before we even got to that level guys um, I had told him that I thought it was very important for all of them to know about me I not because it's like oh yeah you make me known that you have a girlfriend no nothing like that so he did so um, there was like a day that he you know got in contact with his children he has two daughters by the way so he got in contact with them well first with t the mother of his daughters and let them know like hey I want you to know that I'm dating someone um, you know I this is something very serious and I would love for her to meet the children and for them to meet her and then afterwards, um, he spoke to his daughters and let them know that too. So the day before we headed to meet the girls, um, I definitely prayed on it. I, I had been praying on it that came a good experience, not just for them, but for myself too. This was definitely something new for all of us. Um, I'm getting a little bit of the Kia which is like a darker reddish orange color and I'm going to blend that in a little bit with Nana and put that at the outer corner of my eye as well using the exact same brush so I prayed about it and I had talked to my boyfriend I was like you know what like I would love for us to invite your the mother of your daughters out to eat and then it kind of threw him off like what as a woman, I feel that just because she has the title of the mother of his children, she should automatically just have that respect. Just because of that. I don't need any other reason but the fact that she is the mother of my boyfriend's daughters, which he is someone that I love. So I wanted to have more of like a one-on-one -on -one just so if she had any questions, she could feel free to ask me and when i first told a few people like some of my like closest friends they were a little bit confused as to like why would you tell her anything about you um honestly guys the way that i see it is i'm in love with this man i'm wanting to become his wife one day and you never know what might happen in life that me becoming his wife means that I'll be becoming a stepmother to two beautiful girls and if anything was to happen or if they just like feel comfortable telling me anything I'd rather have them do that with me 
than to go tell some stranger something because if that was to happen guess what like i'm gonna make his their mother their father aware like hey like this is going on you know? i just out of respect i just felt it was so important to do that because again dating him came with the package and i wanted that package to feel all the love that i felt you know towards him to them and you never know how life is going to switch up but to if you know the tables were to turn i would want the same respect back color guys that i'm going to get is yamoha yamoha it's like this little grayish blue color and i'm going to put that right on my lid so I told him that I wanted to, you know, sit down, eat with her, just somewhere comfortable. And, like, if she had any questions, if I had any questions, you know, we could definitely go ahead and get them answered. And he, at first, he was kind of, like, thrown off because I guess he wasn't expecting that, you know. Um, but, guys, when I tell you, it was, like, the best experience ever. He introduced me to her introduced me to the to his daughters we went inside and then um you know just like starting like normal conversation we went to like a buffet um you know when my boyfriend and the girls kept getting up to go grab stuff to eat then her and i we were like alone and we were able to communicate and honestly guys it was it was a really great experience for me being the first time that i've ever been in this situation before where i'm dating a man with children i'm having to meet you know the woman that he was with before and the woman that he had children with um it was a really great experience for me and it seemed like it was great for them too and one thing that i did realize that i feel is so important is that the way that he, uh, my boyfriend and i showed respect to the mother of his daughters I think that kind of broke the ice with the daughters and I um, where they kind of maybe felt a little bit more comfortable to be around me because they saw that me and the mom were cool um, that we were okay we were able to sit down have a, a conversation and there was no issues or any bad vibes or anything like that I just thought it was a really beautiful experience um, I personally, I wouldn't change it for the world. I mean, I can't, I don't know what the, you know, what the future holds for us. Um, I hope that we're able to continue to have great communication because the kids see everything that you do. They hear everything that you say, guys. Like, these kids are extremely smart, like super duper smart. All right, so now I'm going to grab a flatter brush and I'm going to get Nubia, which is like the yellow, 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 high, I mean, yellow, 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 yellow highlighted color. And I'm going to put that all underneath my waterline. We'll highlight it, but it's so beautiful, especially once you put the lashes on. I am going to get a little bit of Zuba, which is like the pink color in the palette it's like a pink highlighted color i'm using the exact same brush i'm just going to put that in the inner corner of my eyes v is honey <laughs> uh, the trip with the girls has been amazing i actually really don't want it to ever end um but you know i know that we only have them for a certain amount of time next thing guys that we're going to do is the lips i'm going to put a little bit of the ofra long lasting liquid lipstick in the color Verona and it's such a beautiful like brown nude color now I have gotten pretty pretty tan so this is probably just gonna blend into my lips but it's okay alrighty guys so I did went ahead and put on my lashes I'm using favorite lashes from Dodo's lashes the D105 I swear I think I've used these lashes for almost two months and they're still in really great condition but I know that it is time to upgrade or to get some new ones. Also set my face um, using my Magic Collection Rose Water Setting Spray. You can use whichever setting spray you like. If you coat the mascara using the Full Exposed Mascara from Smashbox. Definitely would recommend that if you haven't done so already or you're someone that's dating 
someone with children definitely have this conversation because kids see everything man they see they hear everything the respect that you put out to the person that you're dating and to their mother their father all of that like you see and also you never know what situation your children will ever be in you don't know if they're gonna grow up and maybe be in a situation where they have kids with someone things don't work out or they end up falling in love with someone that has children and you know you are definitely their biggest examples and I just you know keep faith that this relationship is going to just grow and I hope you guys enjoy this video please make sure to give it a thumbs up if you guys have any other topics that you guys want me to discuss or if you guys have any questions regarding this topic that we spoke about today please feel free to leave a comment down below until next time bye guys